Hi, this is Kathy Dam. I am going to walk you through how you would join the class at our new site at CourseSites.com. If you have not already viewed the other video I made about the design of the course, I please ask that you watch that video first, then come back here. You should have received an email from me inviting you to join my course at CourseSites.com. It might have looked like spam, so you may want to look for it. Some key terms in that email are Professor Dam, Lifespan Development Course, and join me at Core Sites. Those are things you could look for. If you still cannot find that email, I would suggest that you email me either through Web Campus or at katherine.dam at nsc.nevada.edu and I'll resend you that email. Now I sent myself a fake email at a fake student account so I can show you what it would look like to go ahead and join Core Sites. Hi, this is Kathy. So now I'm going to show you how you will accept my email invitation to join Course Sites. I used a fake account I made up at Yahoo. If I go to my inbox, I'll see that my first email is my invitation. Your invitation may look a little different. I plan on just tweaking the words so that you're not confused by it, but it'll look somewhat like this. What I want to do is to click and confirm this invitation and register. So we are going to course sites. Most of you will not have a course site account. Um, there may be a rare occasion where you do, but I doubt that um, any of you do. Course sites is kind of um, uh, a site that is um, like free use and most people wouldn't use it. So I, I would default to um, I need a new account if you um, know that you don't have an account. So I'm going to click on I need a new account. I'm going to go ahead and enter my information. Again, this is fake student information. Please do not send me spam if you see my email. Uh, come up with a um, system here. I'm going to write that down so I don't forget what it was I set my password to be. Uh, go ahead and tell them I'm in the United States and the institution is Nevada State College. I have to go ahead and fill in these funky word things. All right, so I am signed up. I don't need to remember that. So this will be the image that you see after you've done that process. You'll see you start on the Start Here menu. Actually, what you will see is an additional video uh, listed here, and that's the video that I'm creating right now. So I technically can't have it there, but it will be there. I'm going to go ahead and have you click on the Welcome button. Here you will see you have access now to the syllabus and the syllabus quiz. I'm expecting you to read through the syllabus, make sure you understand it, and then take the syllabus quiz. It's got eight questions, it's got my secret words in it, and also some course questions about how we're going to run this course. You need to get 100% on that syllabus before you will have access to any course material. You can retake it a couple times if you need to. Plus, after the syllabus has been submitted, you'll be able to look and see which ones you missed in my feedback. So it's not going to be hard, but you do need to get 100% before I will let you have access to any other learning material. Now I'm going to click on learning materials here. I went ahead and made one available so that I could show you in the video what it would look like. Our first module is the introduction and research module. The other modules will follow below it once you've passed the quizzes for each, uh, the each one prior to it. So if I click on the introduction and research module, you'll see there's some information about what we're learning. Oops, it's missing the course objectives. I'll make sure to click on make that viewable. But you'll see this is the first module and it, you're only responsible for chapter one. Now below you'll see the two videos that I've made that I expect you to view. And then these are the interactive tools that I've created using McGraw's Connect system. And I expect you to go through each of these. So the first two, one is a kind of an interactive kind of flashcard game system. Then there's like a homework where you watch a video and ask some questions about the video. And then when you feel ready to tackle the course, you take the introduction research quiz. So now I'm going to go ahead and show you what that looks like in terms of logging in for the first time using this interactive Connect system. 
So if you're going to log in to the Connect system for the first time, it'll require that you register. But after we do this one time, it will always be available after that. You don't have to re-log in. It will be kind of linked with your course site's website. So anytime you see any of these links, you can click on them and seamlessly go to their system. You might not even realize that you're in their system and not in my system. But it does require that the first time we register. So I'm going to go ahead and click on the first one. You'll see that it's asking me to register with them, and so you're going to want to click Continue. And now it's saying, okay, here's an arrow. We want you to register. And I'm trying this for the first time because I didn't want to register without you seeing it on video, so hopefully I don't hit any glitches. But I'm going to go ahead and put my fake email in. Again, if you can read it, don't send me spam. Hit Submit. Now, this is asking for a registration code. If you purchased an ebook, this registration code will be available with your ebook. If you purchased a hard copy, you will have to buy access to this Connect system. However, there is a free trial. The free trial is on their website listed as lasting three weeks. This course is four weeks. If you want to try to attempt to do it in three weeks, give it a try. Guess what? If it doesn't work in three weeks, you can come back and buy uh, the code to finish your fourth week. So I'm going to go ahead and click on Start Free Trial. Hopefully they won't ask me like my social security number or anything like that. This is the course we are registering for. It's um, the ebook is the Essentials of Lifespan by Santrox. So I'm going to hit submit. So it's asking me for lots of information, and hopefully I can speed up this part of the video so you won't have to get bored. Um, let's see. Oh my goodness, lots of stuff here. I'm going to go ahead and make sure that I accept the terms of the condition, but I don't want to receive any more information from McGraw-Hill, so you can unclick that. Drum roll, please. All right, so it says it's been activated. Now I'm going to go to Connect. And there you go. So this is what you should see. Um, so here is the first kind of interactive tool, and here is Oh, these are out of order. I'll fix this before you see it. Um, but here is the homework, and then this is the quiz. So you will click on these, run through the activities, and there's going to be another video on how to do this kind of thing. Um, but this is where you will start interacting with um, the CourseSmart system. Ta-da!